Hey everybody, it's Justin Harvey, Director of Content here at Nashville Public Television. Thanks for joining us for NPT This Week. We're going to take a look at a lot of highlights for the week coming up. Starting on Tuesday, October 13th at 7 o'clock, we have Mary Tyler Moore, a celebration, a look at her wonderful career, her groundbreaking show. You're going to hear from people like Ed Asner, Carl Reiner, Dick Van Dyke, Oprah Winfrey, talking about the influence that she had on television. Don't miss that one. Following that, we've got another new great show, Secrets of the Dead, The Real Trojan Horse. Going to look at that myth and find out if there might be a grain of truth to it. Archaeologists, scientists are going to look at the archaeological evidence and see if that story actually happened, what it might have looked like. Interesting look at a fascinating story. Take a look at the clip. On Secrets of the Dead, the ultimate sneak attack. I'm going to engineer the conquest of Troy. Homer tells us they used a Trojan horse to get in. Could the Trojan horse be more than an epic myth? The real Trojan horse on Secrets of the Dead. Moving on to Wednesday night. This week at 9 o'clock, we start a new series, a six-parter called The Brain with David Eagleman. This is a fascinating look at that three-pound lump that we all carry around, what goes on in there, how we feel the emotions that we do, how it controls all of our body, what we know about it, what we don't. I think you're going to like it. Wednesdays at 9, coming up on NPT. Take a look. There are 100 billion neurons in the human brain what we feel, what matters to us, our beliefs and our hopes, everything we are happens in here. Also that Wednesday at eight o'clock, we have a new Nova cyber war threat. Really good in-depth analysis by the team at Nova that always takes a great look at topics like this. Wednesday at eight, take a look. Cyber attack. Beyond invasion of privacy or identity theft, cyber warriors can unleash physical destruction with the tap of a key. Can we counter the cyber war threat on Nova? So also this week, we have some really great performance shows. Starting on Friday, the PBS Fall Arts Festival continues with Live from Lincoln Center, Kern and Hammerstein Showboat. This is a watershed musical. It has an all-star cast. Vanessa Williams is in it. Fred Willard is in it. Really fun, really compelling, great show. Check that out on Friday at 8. Saturday night, we have another great musical show of a different variety. We have Eric Clapton, Slow Hand at 70. He's playing at the Royal Albert Hall for the 200th time on his 70th birthday, playing his hits, playing Cream's hits. It's going to be really fun, and to see Eric play in that venue, really nice show. In fact, we have a clip. Check it out. Of local interest this week, we have Pilchuck Dance with Fire. That should be on Thursday at 8 o'clock, and this is about the world-famous art studio and school that is in Washington, founded by Dale Chihuly. It's a really beautiful documentary, and for those of you who remember Dale's exhibit at Chief Wood and at the Frist, this will be a really fun look back. Take a look.
In our category of It's Never Too Late to Start, this week we're looking at Frontline, My Brother's Bomber. That's on Tuesday at 9. If you missed the first two parts of that series, episode 3 airs this week. It's the story of a man named Ken Dornstein, and his brother was on Pan Am Flight 103, which in 1988 exploded over Lockerbie, Scotland. Ken went on a journey through Northern Africa to find the men who were responsible for this bombing. If you missed that one already, check out the PBS Roku channel, the PBS Apple TV channel. Go to WNPT.org and click on the Videos tab and you can find those episodes to watch. Really compelling television, really well worth watching, so take a look at this clip. It was one of the worst terrorist attacks before 9-11 but only one suspect was ever convicted. Filmmaker Ken Dornstein travels to Libya in search of those who killed 270 people, including his brother. Hi, my name is Sean Infanson. I'm an associate producer with Nashville Public Television. My pick of the week this week is Nature, Soul of the Elephant. It airs Wednesday, October 14th at 7 p.m. It's about two filmmakers who spend two years in Africa filming elephants. Their belief is that every elephant that dies naturally, with its ivory, is a victory. This is a beautifully shot, moving film. I recommend it. We've lived in Botswana for 30 years, but we're still searching for something. Join filmmakers Derek and Beverly Joubert as they contemplate the inner lives of these iconic creatures. What is the very soul of the elephant? So thanks for watching the NPT This Week vlog. We've got a couple more picks for you, but we do want to remind you to go to WNPT.org, sign up for our newsletter, find out what's going on at the station, see the entire schedule, and also connect with us using the hashtag NPT This Week. Thanks for watching.